Hello guys and welcome back to the Minecraft Mode Air Force. Today we're going to be building the Vought F4U Corsair aircraft. Now this is built by Kabi, who's here for the video, and myself. I also help with the design. So this is a U.S. Navy and Marine Corps aircraft. It was used in World War II in the Pacific Front, and it's a carrier-based uh, fighter bomber aircraft. As you can see, it's also used in the Korean War as a support role. That's what I read on Wikipedia. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoy the build. And you can use this in your World War II American carriers. But we don't even have any carrier tutorials, so you're going to have to like design your own. Um, but yeah, let's get started on the tutorial. Alright, so first off, we're going to go over here. And we're going to place this lapzuli three blocks above the ground. And then we want to make it six blocks long. So one, two three, four, five, six, and then we're going to add quartz, uh, blue wool, and a white concrete block. Then we're going to add uh, two by three of lapazuli. This is going to be the tail. And then at the very end, we want to add lapazuli, quartz in the front of it, and lapazuli on top, like so. And then we're going to take out dark prismarine stairs and add it in the back corner and also on the bottom corner in the front. Then we're also going to add dark prismarine down here. And let's go on to the front and add dark prismarine slab right underneath the first lapazuli. And then we're going to have two uh, upside down backwards facing dark prismarine stairs. And then we're going to add uh, dark prismarine slabs. We're going to make it six blocks long. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we're going to add in uh, block temporarily here so it can place a skeleton skull, a wither skeleton skull, and then we're going to place a lever and you want to make sure it looks like it's connected to that because this is the back wheel. And then we're going to go to the front and we're going to add in a dark oak wood trap door. And then we want to add an anvil, dark oak wood trap door on top and on the sides. You want to make sure they're closed up. like so. And then at the tip we want to have a skeleton skull. On top we want to have a dark or nether brick fence on top and then dark oak wood fence gates on the sides of it. Diagonally down to the skull like so. Then we're going to add in a birch wooden button on the side of this lapis and also the side of this wool same thing on the other side. And then we're going to add in a dark oak wood trapdoor here. And then three dark prismarine slabs. Another brick stairs facing the front. And then another brick block after it. And then two lapis zulis. Then in the back, we want to take out a dark oak wood trapdoor. And you want to make a two by two. And then we're going to add an extra one to the back one, so it looks like this. Then we're going to add in a blue carpet on top of all the trap doors. And that's pretty much it for that back wing. Now then, we want to take uh, iron bars. We're going to add one to the back of the cockpit. And we also want to add in a dark oak wood trap door in front of that. And then an iron bar right behind that last wheel. And also another iron bar to the side, uh, just on the right hand side of the plane right here in the middle. Then we're going to take out dark prismarine uh, slabs. We're going to add two of them right here. Dark oak wood trap doors on the front and the back of it. And then we're going to go diagonally down and add dark prismarine slabs. It's going to be four blocks long. And then we're going to add another row, dark prismarine slabs. Four blocks wide again, like that. And then we're going to add in, uh, it goes up right here in the front, two blocks long, dark prismarine. And then go dangling up another two slabs like that. Now at the very end, we want to make sure it's curved like that. And then we're going to take out a uh, brick uh, slab, and we're going to add two of them, like that. And in the middle, we want to have a quartz slab like that. 
Then we're going to add in two more Dark Prismarine slabs right there. So you got this shape of the wing. And then for the bottom of this wing, we're going to add Dark Oak Wood Trapdoor in the front. And the back where that other one was. And the spaces in between, we're going to fill that in with Dark Prismarine slab. All right, then we're going to add in blue carpets on the parts of the wing that we can. So there's going to be this layer right here and this other layer. Uh, the rest of our wing, we can't cover it with carpet because then I'll sort of float. So this is the best we can do. So we got that nice gull wing shape. And uh, we're also going to add in a landing gear. So this is actually grindstone, a new block in 1.14 actually pretty nice and you want to make sure it's actually um, underneath the uh, the wing and it's connected like so and you'll pretty much do the same exact wing on the other side it's going to be pretty symmetrical on that front and the last thing we're going to do let's add in another brick uh, slab and you want to place it underneath this part so it's going to be three blocks long and then at the end we want to add a dark oak wood trap door and this is going to be pretty much a bomb that you can carry um, on these aircraft uh, yeah you pretty much do the same uh, exact uh, wing design on the other side all right so i copied the wing to the other side same exact thing you can see this is like the full shape now we're going to also add an end rod to this side and only this side this is like some kind of radar uh, antenna i believe and then we're also going to go to the back. You can see I already did uh, the rear stabilizers across, same thing. And then we're going to add uh, two blocks of Dark Prismarine slabs right on top of each other like so. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the tutorial on the F4U Corsair. Thanks to Kabi for helping build it, the original design for this. And hope you guys like the video. If you do, remember to hit that like button down below. And subscribe if you haven't already because I'll be uploading more videos like this in the future, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.